Happy Thursday, everybody. Welcome on in. Welcome to the stream. Yay. Got Shoots Rage 2 on in the background. Welcome on in, Vinny C. DRM. Welcome. You too. Welcome. Stream Elements. Welcome. DRM, you're the first. Vinny, you're the second. Welcome, everybody. Welcome on into the stream. I hope everybody's having a good day. Happy Thursday. One more day to go, and it'll be Friday <laughs> at the weekend. Uh, still so happy you got the regular show, GIF, on the loading screen. Oh, yeah, awesome. I am so happy that GIF right here is on the loading screen. Yeah, I'm so I'm happy for you. <laughs> it is. Um, but, yeah, welcome on in, everybody. Tonight, we're going to play... I'm going to try to finish up this game, Hexen, for the Sega Saturn. Uh, the last time we played this game was uh, Tuesday night, and... We went very late, so I think we have like two more hub worlds to go and we're done with the game. So I'm like, let's just finish this up and then, uh, yeah, it'll be a toss up. We'll figure out what we'll play next or maybe that's it for the night. But, uh, I'll say what's going on with my life so far. Um, I could beat Castlevania Symphony of the Night, uh, under an hour for PlayStation. I might play that tomorrow night, actually. <laughs> Symphony of the Night on the PlayStation 1. Uh, I've been practicing. Time to show off those skills. Alrighty, Rue. Let's start off with some Hexen. Let's just, let's just, ju let's just jump right into Hexen. F it. We're going right in. Hexen. Where are we? Start that up. Yeah, it's big, it's big life news once you, uh, once you beat Castlevania Symphony of the Night and, uh, Beat it under an hour. <laughs> yeah, pulled off all those glitches and stuff. All right, so Hexen for the Sega Saturn, Raven Software. Um, damn. Hexen SoftBank distributed by GameBank Corp. Hmm. Suspended within Suspended. the fabric of time and space lies the realm of the Chaos Sphere. Realm of the Chaos Sphere. For eons, Sphere. the Serpent Riders, masters of the Sphere, have traveled the dimensions sowing... Where is everybody? Where is everyone? Come, Come on now, get on in! Threatens another world. Where is everybody? We didn't... We didn't... We still have third up in the air. Hexen. A world where magic's legacy has spawned corruption. Where are they gonna get to the fireworks factory? Unholy trinity. It's weird. I know, something's probably up with the Twitch algorithm. I don't know. Warlord Zedek. High Give it like ten minutes or something. Is both judge and jury to all the peoples of Hexen. Hexen. I'm gonna bet it has something to do with this uh, this pin thing. Right there, the of the I managed to pin something to the uh, the chat. Maybe it has something to do Holds with that. Their souls in captivity. Ba, ba, and Manakir, the subtle ba, master of the arcane, weaves his unholy magic to spread fear and weakness. All right, let's just play. We'll let we'll let the peeps pour in. Options, game files. Yeah, no, no biggie. I... Kieran will raise. Hanfest, welcome on in. Havenfest, raid. Take third, take third, take third, take third. Third is open, third is open, take third. Boom, 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 boom. I gotta jump. Welcome on in, Havenfest. Mortal. Do it! Claim third! Claim third! He's not claiming third. I'll just pretend that uh, you are third. Welcome on in. Because you're the third chatter. Alright, so we're on the, the second to the last hub world. Welcome on in. I hope you're doing well. It's been an awfully a long time since I played this game. Two days ago. The Cheerio! 
Let's see. Do I have any? I have no, um, I have nothing. No, uh, no gems. No gems. Jump. Yeah, I wouldn't be too. I wouldn't be too concerned about it as well. I'm not. I'm not gonna be. Um. Okay, hold on. I remember this from the other day. You have to hit the two switches. Oh crap! This guy throwing shit at me. Come on. I need to get some health. There's something over there. So let's see if I can run and get it. Oh, it's one of those yellow disc things. Ready, sit, run and jump. Chilling, eating animal cookie. Wait, hold on. They went from animal crackers to animal cookies? That's so nuts. No animal crackers. Animal cookies. It's the other word. Use cookies to be safe. Oh. <laughs> Boom. Jump. Run and jump. I think there's a way to jump up there. There you go. That guy pulled down. Now. Ready, set, run and jump. Yo, Heaven Fest redeemed third. Yay. There we go. Add points. Add points. Heaven Fest. You get 250. Yay, welcome on in. Awesome. Hovenfest, you're the third. Welcome on in. Yay, we got third. Yeah. Woohoo. Now we can play the carnival game. Yo, Zorak, welcome on in. How you doing? Dear, I'm giving a gift sub to Hovenfest. Thank you so much for the gift sub. Appreciate you. Enjoy those sweet emotes. You almost pushed it, but then that would have been a dick move. Ah. Welcome on in too, Zorak. Hope, hope you're doing well. Yeah, so Zorak, I got your message in Discord about the Ankh uh, being tomorrow. I mean, I, we'll see if I, I, I'll do it, but I was thinking about playing Castlevania Symphony of the Night because I have that on my mind. I, I might I might play Castlevania Symphony of the Night tomorrow for PS1, but that could all change though, because I, I was planning on going to my uh, my retro game store tomorrow, see what they got. I might pick up something while I'm there and I might stream it, whatever I pick up. I've, seen, I've had that happen before. Symphony of the Night every time, yeah. I, I like figured out like how to break the, the PS1 version. The Saturn version is is uh you know always broken. <laughs> it's the broken version of the game, but the PS1 version, after all these glitches I just discovered, I could like I could totally like, break the PS1 version. Yeah, you can post the anguies, awesome. Uh oh. Real good and bad here. Layoffs. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. You got layoffs. That sucks. 
it hit it today, but you get all you all get off next week off. You survive. Okay, that's good. Yeah, sorry to hear that. That's 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 a terrible thing to go through. Um I've um haven't I haven't experienced the layoff myself, but I've been in the situation where I was told, hey, your your position is going to be eliminated soon. And I and I had like two months to act, and luckily I acted in time. So, um, but it's, it's a, that's a sucky feeling. To, like, I mean, at least, you know, I, I, I had like some notice, but like usually when that happens, they just hit you when you least suspect it. So, yeah, glad you survived. Just, yeah, I'm just sucky that's a sucky thing to go through it yeah it most people oh they volunteered oh they volunteered to be let let go is that what you mean like they gave they gave an offer and they're like all right just quit I, I know, I know my old job where I work. They did that for some of the IT staff during one year. They just, they gave them like an offer. First staff gets the best deal. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I think, I think that's what they call it, severance, yeah. Yeah, so... Two. All they said was, when asked how, how good, they said, NDA good, yeah. Hey, Brunair, welcome on in, how you doing? Welcome, Brunair, happy Thursday. Playing some more Hexen today. Okay, cozy during the snow. Oh, it's snowing by you, oh shit. Yeah, it did get cold all of a sudden, um, like this week. Like, I was checking the forecast. It was supposed to be, um, like, in the 30s today. And I was like, oh, I'm not used to this cold. And it, it wasn't going to go back up to the 50s at all. I'm like, ugh. So we're in trouble. <laughs> yeah, this is a good game. It's, it's let's get lost the game. All right, so I got the clock tower piece. Huh. Have to figure out where to go. Uh, uh, all right, so I hit the two switches there. I wonder what that means. Hit the two pages. So I, I might go to my local game store tomorrow after work. That's this. This is the store that got the PlayStation One trade, the big PlayStation One trade in. Continue. The big PlayStation One trade in. Uh, the full set. There's one game in particular I'm interested in getting if they still have it, and it's Punky and Skunky for the PS One. And it's supposed to be a platformer. If I could get that game. I might have to play that game when we get it. Game where you play a skunk. I think Jalico put it out. Punky Skunky. Ready, 
Holy shit, jump. Oh, wait, I gotta hit the switch. All right, so I have to do this all over again. That's gonna suck. Um, what does the cross do? That's a weapon. What does that do? That gives you full health. Okay, cool, I didn't know that. I should have used that before. I would have totally used that full health before. That switch ready set jump. Jump. Ooh, do I like the torches here? Uh oh, somebody's killing me. There we go. It just made the doom growling noise. Or the, the growling noise from Duke Nukem 3D. Alright, run and jump. What are these tiles here? I'm about to find out. There you go. Throw it, throw it. Yo, Tanita, welcome on in. How you doing? I'm doing great. Playing some more Hexen tonight. Playing some Hexen for the Sega Saturn. Nice. Yeah. There we go. Jump over here. Hit that switch. Jump up here. Get the clock gear. Streets of Rage 2 in the background, yep. Yeah. I really like this new setup where I have the CRT going on in the background while I'm playing. Gives it a little extra ambience. Now, I was thinking about doing it on that wall over there. I'm gonna I have pixel art paintings on this side of the wall um that you can't see. I'm gonna move them over there. I'll probably do that this weekend. Uh just hit, um hang them up on that wall. Um only problem is I don't know if I don't know if there's like a lighting source that's gonna pick it up. Yo, King Hades, welcome on in. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. I don't know if I'll have to add another lighting source to light up the that wall in the back. Um, maybe I get like some cheap strip lighting on, on the side just so the paintings can show. I'm doing great. Why don't you just get a cheap projector and? project some retro games on the entire wall behind me that's a good idea actually put a yeah retro uh projector hang it over hang it up over there i'm i'm, I'm think i got like all that extra space on that wall and i'm not using it and like in a perfect world like i have a bookshelf i have a bookshelf on this side of the room there where i'm pointing at that's where i keep all my sega saturn games I wish I could just like put them over there, but then I would have to get rid of the CRT. But it's like it's like pick your poison. Which one? Which one do you want to do? Give up the CRT? Put the put the games on the put the shelf over there. So I, I it, there's, there's a, I got a couple ideas how I can improve it. I just haven't like put them in put the wheels in motion yet. But I'm getting there. Yeah, the Saturn collection. I, mean, I have I have some of the move the camera to the left side. I could um I mean we got we got that. We got that. This is the bookshelf right there. And I got my pillows and then we got like over there. Oh crap. My camera like freaked out for a second there. <laughs> yeah. I guess I guess I I mean any kind of any kind of setup to the stream would have to be done off the stream, but um, that's a weekend project. I feel we'll get there. Oh, I got this really cool uh, light. 
uh, Capcom sent me some free swag. I got this really cool uh, Capcom Creator light that I've been like, I just put on my, um, I just, I mean, I wish I could like put it somewhere where you guys could see it. Like maybe put it in the back over here. Put it right next to the, the virtual boy. Yeah, it lights up, but you guys can't read what it says. It just lights. King of Hades wants to see a random retro item. You got it. Oh, I'm already in this mode. Um, all right, what can we show off today? Um, so we got Contra Hardcore for the Sega Genesis. I was I was totally gonna put that on the TV too, but we got Streets of Rage too. So yeah, that's the random retro item. Oh Contra Hardcore. Yeah, that game is tough. Tough as nails, Contra Hardcore. Um, no life bar, you get hit, you die, sort of deal, you got three lives, two lives, that's it. I don't think the Konami code is in it, but, uh, yeah. I usually, like, the furthest I could get, I can get the Castlevania ending, or the, yeah, the Castlevania ending I can get. Uh, that's the furthest I'll, I'll, I'll go. I'll try doing a strafe jump on there. Get a frame of reference. Oh shit. I think I could strafe jump. This castle almost pretty tough. Jump. No, I can't I can't make that jump. Jump, jump. Van Halen, jump! Uh-oh. Guy's gonna kill me. Put in here. Hit the switch. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Keep throwing these things at him. 26. Go. I'm dead. I'm dead. Just as I'm making progress here. Throw that at Oh yeah, use the sword. Right way. Oh crap. I'm dead. Dead. I knew it. So I have like no health items. I know you start with the health item technically. We'll do this again. So I hit Z. Z right two times. I need to get the mana. I think that potion gives me infinite health too. Open up. There you go. Grab some mana. There you go. Turn right. Come on. Sword. Combine mana. Back out. One. Has the snow finally hit Jersey? Nah, we haven't hit snow yet. I don't think we're gonna get snow at all. Um, cause I checked the I checked the weather report. We're we're gonna be just fine. There's no there's no snow going on. We're uh, it's been snowing where you were at for the last three days. Oh shit. How hard? Like how how um? I, I was about to say how hard this how hard's the snow like? Getting a lot of snow, or is it just flurries or bad snow? Shit. Got some yesterday in Quebec. Yeah. Two White Houts. Oh shit, that's actually pretty bad. <laughs> there we go. Got 
switch. Get those mages. Yep, there you go. Get some more mana. So we gotta hit this switch up here. Get the cog. Get that guy. There you go. We're in the center. We got the cog, right? Yeah, we got the cog. Uh, then two. Living in Michigan sucks. Got caught in that first one. Nothing like doing five five an hour. Yeah. Lake effect happening in Buffalo. Oh shit. Uh. They could receive two feet of snow. Oh shit, that's a lot of snow. Let's do a safety save here. Hmm. Oh, whoops. <laughs> All right. Let's start rolling out. Go. One, two, three, go. Boom. There we go. One. Nothing here. Oh, no. Get him with the hammer. Yeah, I hope it doesn't snow over the weekend. I don't think we're... I don't think we're capable of, of getting snow. And, like, handling the, uh, the amount of traffic and the snow and stuff. Oh, there's a portal here. We got a portal. Okay, so those switches for the portal do something. We know for a fact now. No. I go this way. Get the get the bat. Do you need winter tires in your state? Um my car has all season tires, so I think we're set. But uh no, we don't really need winter tires. I mean I guess it's good to have if you live if you live out in like the, I'm gonna say, that, live out in the country, live out in the woods where like the, where like the the plot, like the roads aren't treated as well. Um, when ice, ice is present on the uh, on the roads, then I'd say yeah, winter tires probably go are necessary. But like my car uh, has, I'm pretty sure it has all season tires on it, so it's good. Yeah, people can decide. I know in some states people put tr they put chains around their uh their tires for traction. Ooh. Got some growling. Throw the flushette at him. Chains hardcore. I really know that. You know, I know how I know the chains on the tire. Um, for that movie Jingle All the Way, Phil Hartman's character is like, Hey, Jack, got to make sure you put the chains on the tire. And he's like, I'll put the chains on you. Because <laughs> he was jealous of him because he was hitting on his wife. Not looking forward to freezing rain. Yeah, it's that's. I don't like freezing rain either. You really feel. You really feel it. Yeah, I miss him too. It was good actor. That that's where that's where I remember the the whole chains on tire things from that movie. Cause cause in that movie I, that movie took place in Minnesota, I think. So it's it's naturally cold there all the time. What happened here? Ooh. Run and jump. 
death. I knew it. Continue. It's going to continue where we left off. Yeah, it's sad. In Michigan, it is illegal to have chains on your tire. Okay. Okay, maybe it's not a thing that... <laughs> to have chains on your tire. Maybe that's like an old thing too, like from the 60s or, or 50s, chains on the tire. It damages the, oh yeah, definitely. That'll definitely scratch up the pavement. Apparently it's also illegal to do donuts in your car on the road. That that messes up the street too. That's a big hefty fine. Yo, Zeph, welcome on in. Think it's an old thing, no one does that anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. I only remember that I remember, remember hearing that because I cause uh the movie that I referenced jingle all the way. Uh-oh. Jump up. Jump up. There you go. That guy just got ripped apart. Okay, so I can't just jump in there. Oh, there's... Okay, so there's some med kits in here. Get my sword out. There you go. Claw. Yeah, the sword's off. This sword's awesome. It's, it's just that it sucks. That uh, in order to use it, it requires mana. I wish there was like a non mana sword or something. What's in here? Blue mana. Yep, there. There's a there's a life refill. Let's see. Let me get up here. Oh snap. Uh oh. Uh oh. Life. Yes! Bingo. That was good. Alright, let's use our mana. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, let's see. There we go. Boom! Platinum helmet. Nice. We open this. You need the rusted key. Okay, we need a rusted key to go through that door. Hit the switch. Hit a switch. What does that switch does that opens that? Liber? Oh, Lieber. Run. Run. I'm getting killed. Throw. Run. Run. Bingo. There we go. 39. Okay. Get that. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna safety save. I'm gonna keep safety saving no matter what. Move someplace warm. Move to Florida. Move to Florida. Florida is nice. Hell's a nice time this year. Yeah. <laughs> Get that guy. America's wank. <laughs> That's funny. Hot during the summer. You know, I think that's that sucks about Florida weather-wise. Hurricanes. Hurt. You're, you're you're always at a risk of hurricanes. All the time. Every summer. I mean now now like every year when we get a get a hurricane, usually we, we get hit with like the uh the after storm or something. Like uh like the, the tropical storm will get hit from the hurricanes as a result. But the one the one hurricane 
that got that that hit us uh hurricane sandy that did a lot of damage to our state uh i think people are still recovering it sucks i'm dead oh not dead get that guy Jump, jump, jump. Get him. There we go. Let's see here. There's something right over there. Run. Porka, porkalator. We got the porkalator. <laughs> You're down in Texas a couple years ago. Got pulled over for driving in the snow when they shut everything down until you see your license. They shut everything down. Oh. Oh, like, during the... Oh, it was a couple years ago. Okay. Come on. Throw it. Get him. Nice. What do we got here? Jump up. And... Climb out. Open the door. I can't open the door. The door is locked. Huh. Interesting. Ready, set, running. Maybe you gotta hit that switch and then run all the way over there. Cardboard the shovel the snow. I mean, I guess you could you could do that if you're in a pinch. You forget to pack a shovel in the car. You you were definitely in a pinch. I'd say that would work. Cardboard. You could also put cardboard under the tires to get some traction if you're stuck. I've seen that go down. But it's also that's also dangerous because the card the you know, wet cardboard can just slip. It works until it get yeah exactly that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a run for this. Ready, set. Oh, wait, no, I did hit the switch. All right, let's check the the map. Run, jump, run, and jump, run, jump. Run, jump, run, jump, run, jump. There's something over here. Nope, there isn't. <laughs> There's nothing over there. All right. Oh, got a key. Rusted key. There we go. Black Friday started here. Same in U.S. It started where you're at in Canada? You got Black Friday? It's next Friday for us. Um... My uh, my local game store, Digital Press, they're having both stores are having a sale. Uh, it's twenty percent off, but if you visit both stores in the same day, you get thirty three percent off. So like, if I go to the Springfield store and buy something, I'll get the twenty percent off there. I take my receipt over to the uh, the one in Clifton, and I'll get thirty percent off there. And then I could take, I think I could take the same coupon back to the other store and get 30% off. Making a lot of driving around. Ooh, got the medical flasks. So it's like, you got to plan out how you're going to, you know, if you hit both stores, how you're going to get the, the best deal. But I still think 20% off is a pretty nifty deal for, uh, for games. Usually at their NABA event, which is like the last Saturday of every month, I get um, I get 15% off because I'm special. I'm special. I get the 15% off. Normally, if you wear the you wear the the store's T-shirt on these NABA events, you get 10% off. Um, but I get 15% off because I'm special. 
some really good deals. Like how I got that Steel Battalion controller a couple years ago. You got two you got two PS5 games, Deals and Honorary. I hear Sonic Frontiers is getting a a Black Friday sale. I think it's gonna be like thirty dollars. I might just scoop that one up. When that you know, when that deal hits. So I really want to try Sonic Frontiers. I'm actually glad I didn't buy it face uh, value uh, 60 if they're going to have a 50% off deal on that. So. Okay, so I got some medical flasks here. This is good. It's only Walmart. Yeah, that's what I heard too. It's only Walmart. And I think it's online only. Which is good, cause I'll I could I could wait. I'm already waiting, like a couple weeks to play that game. I'm not spoiling myself at all with it. What opened up here? So I think I have to hit both switches for that to open. It's my it's my spine tingling feeling here is to open all the switches. Actually, hold on. Did I, did I get them all? One, two, there's maybe two more to open. We hit that switch. In store, it's full price. Oh, shit. That's the last one. That should, that should do something. No, these guys are spawning now. Oh, no. Get him. Why'd I hit that switch? I feel like I. Oh. What is this? Demon Codex. There we go. Come on, get these guys out of the way. Can you price your online store? Price match it? That'd be funny. Price match it. Remember that was like a big big deal in the past. If you go to Best Buy, you took your receipt somewhere else um, to another store. If it was like cheaper, they'd give you the difference. That was a pain in the neck to do because you had to like go... You had to get in your car and drive around and find the price and then they price match it and stuff yeah, it's been a while since that happened that's back when people used to go to stores and, and shop which is a it's a, it's not a thing anymore sadly so a d cannot use that there so a d so I got a little bit of a puzzle here with the book and a gear. Come that way. Hmm. I feel like I'm running in circles for good cause. For a very, very good cause, I'm running around in circles. Uh, no. What if we go this way? Oh, I see the bridge appeared. I still have no idea what these discs do. I, I think you could use them as a weapon. It's not really clear what you can do with these. I probably could look it up in the manual, the English manual. All right, before I walk over this corridor, I'm gonna save. Save scum this. All right. Hmm. Start. I hear demons. I think we could leave this level and go somewhere else. Oh, something over here. I think 
I, yeah, I think I explored everything. Yeah, so let's leave the level and go find something else. Hmm. Kenny, welcome on in. How you doing? Playing some Hexen tonight. Some more Hexen. And I'm getting lost. I I'm starting to understand the formula to this game. If you get lost, you gotta leave the level, go somewhere else, get lost there, leave the level, go back to the level you got lost on originally, and just run around in circles several, several times until you go nuts. That's how you play Hexen. Let's see, I go inside here. Now, can I use the book over here? Can't use that item there. What about this? Clock here. Nope. Never tried it. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's a, I, I think this is a good this is a good walkthrough to go through every now and then. I really want to try heretic. Heretic. I, I call it heretic. Heretic. The original Hexen game, and then Hexen 2 I gotta play. Got the clock here. Oh, there's. Uh oh, I'm in trouble. Now we're in trouble. I wonder if I could get quick mana here. Uh oh, they're, they're shooting me. That didn't do anything. Flechette. Get that guy. Come on, get that guy. There we go. Hit the thing. All right, let's see. Can I use the, uh, can I use anything on here? Nope. Nope. The books don't, okay, those books don't do anything. I gotta find more mana somehow. idea what's inside these things. Nothing, it appears. Um, is that secret room that we saw? Um, okay, let's return out. If we could figure out how to get out of this room. guys behind me. What the hell? Oh, there's there's like a thing here. Come on. Let's see here. Climb out. Get this. Fall down this hole, I get a flush yet. Huh. There you go. If I fall down this hole, I get a flush yet. Just drop flushettes on them. Oh, we got what we got? What's down here? Instant death? Shit. That sucks. That was instant death. So I gotta start this over. Ugh, I gotta do this whole level over again. Damn it. Okay, so don't fall down that, that center hole thing. 
you'll die instantly. Uh, but I need, I still need to do something. Switch here. All right, so we came out of that room. We go down the center, right? Another room somewhere. There, no. Oh. Dun, 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 dun. These guys. Uh oh, somebody's killed me. Oh, that makes it, that teleports him. There you go. Like instant kill. Well, shit. There you go. Out of the way. Lost once again. <laughs> That's terrible. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight. There we go. Bingo. Oh, here we go. Here we go. That switch, does that do anything? Oh, there's the chalice. Crater of mites. We got another one. Wonder what these switches do that I'm hitting. What purpose do they serve? Do a quick safety save before I jump on this elevator. Cause I think I'm just gonna get killed, like easily. Um Cool. All right, let's go. Let's go. Hey, hey, hey. D seven, keep shooting him. Oh crap, that's death. There you go. Yeah, just keep throwing these at him. Oh shit. Shit. Get him. And then you come down here and pick up one, another one. Oh crap. Get him. There we go. More mana. 45. More mana. 89. What does this switch do? More mana. Keep getting those manas. More flushettes. What? 
chip out. Get him with the sword. Use the magic sword! Let it flush it. Two hits, they still go down. All right, that's another switch. All right, run over here. Run and jump. Plus one. Come on down, flush it. Jump down, get out. Pull that up. Oh, 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 don't fall out. Hit the switch. All right, I'm gonna go for a safety save. We're in a better position to use a safety save now. All right, go. Go. Cool. Use the elephant. There we go. Oh, that kills everybody on sight. Oh, run! Don't die! Don't die! Oh, we're not dead. We're not dead yet. It sucks, like, switching between, like, items and stuff. Use this chalice. I think that gives us health. Slow dial. 50. Sword! Sword! That was pretty tough. I went from having full health to like no health all of a sudden. There you go. Hold down, get the flechette. Grab the thing. Come on out. Two. There you go. That's well crap. Alright, jump out. Jump out. Uh uh. One, two, three. Come on. Four. Five. Come on down. There we go. Perfect. I hit this switch. These switches mean something, I know for a fact. What else could they be? Back, go forward, jump. I hope these guys don't respawn. Guess I've been here already, that's good news. We've hit the switch. Here. Ready, set, go, 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 jump. There we go. Hit the switch. Right, I'm doing my safety save. So we got all the. Finish the castle wall. I guess we could move back down to the lower level. 
Ugh, saving. Alright, here we go. No, don't th don't f I fucking fell in the hole. Damn it. Oh, it's a good thing I safety saved. <laughs> That's why we safety save. All right, I'm gonna run down here. Let's see, what are we missing? Mana. There you go. These guys seem to respawn all the time. Oh, combined mana. There we go. That's what we want. Alright, so if I run inside... There be like an entrance somewhere. Oh, this goes down. Clock gear. Awesome. Oh. Oh, that's what that is. Booby traps. Those are booby traps. There we go. This was in here before. Clock here. Boom. There we go, that guy just blew up. On the other side, right? Looking around here. He's got some clock ears. Got to figure out where the clock goes. Oh. There we go. This is new. Clock gear. Oh shit. Oh uh, no. What do we got here? I think we got them all. There we go. Cool. Alright, keep looking around for some unsuspecting areas. around been here already there we go Entered through this room. What else opened up? Back and left. There we go. Let's see, did like another wall open up? That wall's been there. Huh. Yep, I'm lost. <laughs> I'm lost again. It's the heck, 
the Hexen experience. I can't find where I'm supposed to go. Uh, I mean, there's a little portal door here. We've been inside that portal door. Um, is there another portal door on the other side? You would think there would, there would be. That doesn't seem to be the case. Nope, nothing. All right, we're lost. I, I mean, do I go back through that portal door I was just in? According to the map, it looks like I explored everything. Yeah, I guess we could go back through that, that door. Let's see what's inside. Maybe something else opened up that we didn't know about. All right, do our good old safety save in case something happens. All right. All right. Go. Run out. Jump. This looks new. Where are these enemies coming from? The good old where do I go, exactly. Featuring where the fuck do I go? And where do I go? That switch. I was already here. I do something to this statue. No. Nope. Oh, where did this guy come from? There we go. was like a blocked path in this uh this cave i wonder if that's open now let's see nope this door is still locked Thought you explored everything. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. It's not like we can look at a walkthrough either, because we know that the walkthrough is not very <laughs> proficient. We have a letter A book and a letter D book. And we have four cog wheels. Clock tower wheels. Like, where are we supposed to use those? Do I use them on this, this body here? What about this book? Yeah, I don't think this is where we're supposed to go, so let's run back out. There is a map, but the map is n the map is not very helpful, let's put it that way. Like, okay, there's an altar here. 
Do I put the book on the altar? Do I put the the gear on the the altar here? I mean, it's it looks like an altar. It's not an altar though. This is the map where I got the two. What you would call it? I got the two the two books. There's the four gears in the other map. So, I mean, but more than likely, if I've been I've been here already and I'm not making any progress, chances are that this is not the level where I'm supposed to be. I walk across here. And I don't think I could fall. I'm not, I don't think I'm supposed to fall down. Dead. Yeah. Okay, so it would be like a complete waste to even progress. So I'm just going to load my save and just turn around and go back out to the castle. Uh, well, real quick, I could take a quick look, a quick peek. Is there anything over here that we missed? No? All right, back into the portal. Big circle inside. Anything in here? Maybe I'm supposed to do something with the gear in this big giant room. that there can't use that there let's see until something happens nothing let's try the book yeah there's nothing nope yeah there's nothing here break the statues down Yo, my Victus, welcome on in. Never played this or Hexen. Yeah, this is my first time playing as well. I'm clueless. Where to go? Heard that? Ever heard that one before? There's a switch up there. I see there's a tiny switch. If I stand on here and hit mash B like crazy, does that do anything? No? I go into this room. I'm about to take a look at my, my map. There's nothing inside that. Well, hold on. Let me let me run out. Yeah, there's nothing in here. <laughs> in here um I'm gonna have to like look at every single nook and cranny of this castle oh this is new that's new that's new that's new that is new that is new never mind I found it I found where to go this is different I know where to go. Let's load the save up. Got to go into the castle center. And there is a path. There is a secret. 
It is so secret that I missed it my first time around. Okay. Run. Out this way. Jump out. Strafe jump. Strafe jump. There we go. That's like hidden. You gotta go. Uh, uh, uh. No, no. No. We don't want that. Not there. Up oh, right here. Get him. Come on, get him. Get the get the life. There we go. Run. That switch there. Oh, the gear is in here. There's a gear. There's a bunch of gears in here. Oh. There you go. Get the gear. One gear. Two gear. Three gear. Four gear. What happens now? Clock. Why is there a clock here? Is that clock supposed to do something when it strikes midnight? Find out. No, it just turned. Okay, the, the the clock just turns. That's all it does. Um, do I have to give it the books. Nope. All right, let's find out what what that opened. Clock. Oh, this makes the thing go up and down. Okay, so the clock goes up and down. It makes this elevator go up and down. Now there's a switch here. Oh, and it just made us warp. Ethereal travel. Weird. We just warped into this room. What is this? We warped into a weird room. We got 20 health. That's probably not the good time to save. <laughs> I probably saved at the wrong time. Alright, uh, so just gotta... This is a game of survival now. Let's see, hit the switch. What happens now? Oh, we traveled in time. Hex and the sword. Green mana. I need health and bad. This new room. Oh, uh, what do we got here? Get this one. I should need the axe key. 82. I should, like, save my mana sword for, like, another use. Get the health. Ready, set, run, and jump. Ready, set, run, and jump. What else? Boom, get that other guy. Nice, we did it. 
punch. Oh, snap. There's an enemy in there. Oh, shit. Come on, there we go. Hit that switch. What's on the other side? Punch. Ooh, quartz flask. Nice. Let's see what's inside here. Another flask. Here we go. Everything's coming up Millhouse. Ready, set, go. Another flask. Get him. Come on, there we go. We've got the hammer of retribution. There we go, one more hit. Combine mana. Awesome. Alright, do a safety save here. Perfect. Finally found where, where we're supposed to go. Let's see what this next area is. Go. There we go. Alright. Uh, let's see, do I go down? I don't think I'm supposed to go down there. It, it doesn't look like a path that you go down in. There we go. Climb up here. Oh, what we got? More of these guys. Throw the throw the hammers at them. They should go down pretty quick. They do. Liquid. Oh, there's a okay. A portal opened up. One portal. One of those portals opened up. Let's see here. So if we go straight, yeah. take some time off the holidays. Have yeah, yeah. No, we're taking off. Um, I'm taking off Thanksgiving. Uh, I took off Friday for Black Friday. Uh, from work. So that should be good. Ugh. Yeah, so we have off Thanksgiving. I took off Friday. Usually we don't get Fridays off at our job. Um, oh, snap, oh, snap, snap. Go. Four day weekend. Yep, for me. So, that should be cool. Really cool. Get to fill up on on turkey turkey dinner and drink that's gonna be great there we go one two here we go the library Let's probably pick up another book in this library to go down the bookshelf. Watch. You know, I probably have to put the book that I picked up. Why am I using my health? Don't use that. Oh. Hmm. Oh. I used the book. On the bookshelf. What did that do? I used the book on a bookshelf. What did the bookshelf do? Shit went down. Shit went down in the in the bookstore. now. 
Usually eat tur turkey at Christmas with your family. I know it's a big tradition in USA, the Thanksgiving turkey. Yeah. You know, it's good. The uh, deep fried turkey I've had uh, on Thanksgiving. That's that's really good. Deep fried turkey. York skull. That's what we picked up. Can't use that there. York. From Hamlet. Deep fried turkey. Yeah, there was a fire safety video that went out uh, with William Shatner <laughs> about the dangers of uh, deep frying a turkey. And it was just somebody did an auto tune of him singing, I want a deep fried turkey. Want a deep fried turkey. Uh -oh. There we go. Moistier, tastier turkey. Deep fried turkey. Did I buy the turkey like that? I think it comes in, um you buy the turkey, um, you gotta deep fry yours. I think you 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 do it outside on like a big pot and uh you fill it up with oil, but you don't fill it all the way. Um, and then when you put the turkey in, uh, they say you're supposed to, like, practice with water, um, because if you overfill the pot and then you put the turkey in, the oil just goes everywhere, so it's like, there's a lot of, like, a lot of dangers associated with deep frying a turkey. That guy's gonna... No! No! Crap. Why'd I fall for that? The dungeon key. I fell for the oldest trick in the book. What the hell did I just pick up? Oh, secret. Alright, there's something over there. That's what I was looking for. Secret. There we go. Throw the thing in there. Keep throwing that. Okay, so if I hit the switch. Don't get why the store's open on Thanksgiving. Port yeah, exactly. Yeah, I never understood that, too. Working in retail on Thanksgiving. So people could get, you know, 20% 20 20 off on that store-branded TV, you know? Wow! That switch just drops you into a pit and you die instantly. Yeah, wait till the next day. Exactly. You see the videos, everybody getting trampled over uh, a TV. Alright, so I have to go this way. Right, I'm not gonna run towards the... Wait, I already went in here. <laughs> go. It's this one. No, it's... Yeah, it's this one. Go. No! What is this? The dragon skin bracers? All right, so don't go for that bait on the bed. That's how, how you get killed. So there is a, there's a trap here. Uh, 
that switch. More safe to do uh, online shopping and stuff, I think. Uh... I remember one year I was able to get a. This was like 15 years ago. I was able to get a hard drive for like. It was like a, it was a 500 gig external hard drive for like 20 bucks. This was like 2006, but it was like an HP. It was like one of those little like USB things. Weren't that good, you know, speed wise, but it, it did the trick. So. I didn't, I didn't, uh, I remember I, I, <laughs> I went there at a time when, it, when, you know, the stores were all empty, and I was like, the first time I ever saw a store that was empty, I was like, oh, yikes, empty store. Okay, what else haven't I looked at? This guy. Oh, oh booby traps. Best Buy is dying? I don't think they're dying. I, um, I'll tell you what, though. Amazon's definitely... Definitely... Uh, making some of these businesses go out of business, I must say, though. So why, why go to a, a big, you know, big box store when you could just go shop online? I definitely think there, there's some something uh, involved there. But I guess some, you know, people still go to you know brick and mortar stores because like I don't know, big box stores. I meant to say, um, for the sake of convenience, they don't want to like wait two days for it to be shipped. You know, some people just will, you know prefer the stuff to be there. So they just quickly go set it up. That's why they'll, they'll, they'll still go to big box stores. And if they just, you know, either they're too lazy to, to drive or go somewhere or just want to, like, be home and stuff. They're, they're home all the time, like me. Um, you know, then we'll go buy stuff online. That's why people did it. Poorly, yeah. We're gonna go to like a Target or something, big box store like that. There's always the self checkout, uh, which is annoying. There's a, especially when there's like a huge line just for the self checkout, and then you go to the the regular checkout line, and there's no line <laughs> for that. Some people prefer the self checkout. They wait for it. I walk on that step, I get crushed. Interesting. What if I throw the flush head in there? Does it, does it touch them? Oh, it does. And I still get hit. Yeah, this is the Japanese version of Hexen, and it's fully in English. There's, like, no difference between the English and the Japanese version here. Hmm. Do a safety save here. I have a feeling if you just run in there, something... I think that's where you have to go. Who knows? This castle level is really huge, though. Alright, run in there. 
Yep, there's nothing in here. Okay. How to get in. Can't go that Oh, no, no. Almost died. Use my last potion. Fuck it. All right, run down. Let's see, where else are we missing? I need a key for that. Let me go down in here. We've been in this room. There's the trap room. We need a key for that. This is the church area. We've been in here. Technically, there's nothing else to check out here. Yeah, there's... Well, hold on. There might be something. Hold on. So, hold on. Do I just run down here? Nope, that's death. Instant death. Okay, nothing in there. Save. Yeah, so when I game control, I'm just going to run back out. Yo, Elster, welcome on in. Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. All right, I'm just going to run out to the... That, that portal. Elster wants to see a random retro item with an arm's reach. You got it, Elster. Two random retro items. Okay, cool. Well, I think I, I showed some of this. I'll show Copy of Echo the Dolphin Jr. for the Sega Genesis. By the, uh, the Sega Club for kids and Knuckles. And then let's see what else we got. Uh, show off a 32x game. Pitfall, the Mayan adventure for the 32x and Knuckles. Thank you for dreaming that reward. All right, so I think I got to jump into this portal here. Let's see where this takes us. Watch this takes us back out to the hub world. Yeah, this takes us to the hub world. Which I don't think there's anything else out here. I mean, we'll take a look. I highly doubt it. I know this is a clock tower in here. Maybe I have to go back into that room. There was like a room in like another portal. Maybe that's open. Well, it's time to get lost. We're definitely lost. I have no idea where I am. I'm gonna continue to not know where I am until I find out where I am. All right, let's go back into this room here. Maybe, maybe that doorway opened up. Cause it wasn't open before. And I have a good feeling it might be open up. Oh, where did that guy come from? That's a good indicator that we might might have to be in here. So if these enemies are appearing. Yep, new enemies here. Oh. Some crystal vial. Those crystal vials weren't there before. They respawn. Disc of Repulsion. Oh, that door isn't open. Maybe I could just walk up to it really quick. Run out. Wee. Wee. Wait. Wee. Jump out. Maybe there's something down here, like a switch. That'll open that door. Crystal vial. Come on. Jump up here. Jump, jump, jump. 
Is there anything behind this door? <clears throat> Doesn't look like it. So if I go out through this little thing here. <clears throat> no, it's nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna run back out to the main map ma area. back out i don't know all right it's time to get lost again <laughs> this castle area just when you thought you were you made progress turns out we didn't make any progress at all go disc of repulsion got these little gaps in the road here yo day man welcome on in good to see you First, you want to lurk? Enjoy that lurk. Yeah, Dayman. Come on in. Spirit of the Dayman. Hey, welcome. How you doing, Wolf? Playing that Hexen. Like, I doubt we have to go... Okay. Yeah, it seems like these enemies keep spawning. like yeah i think the trick to this game at this point is to just hug the wall till you find something maybe i have to go back to that room with the clock tower the clock so we could try doing that if we could find it clock was not in here side just got home with tacos nice up oh, it's good tacos there's anything else over here um i mean we could try going up the elevator see if there's anything anything that was missed figuring out where to go sucks It, okay, it's over here. All right, climb up the elevator here. All right, let's just quickly look around.
nothing. All right, let's go back into that that other warp. Now, do we have to go in here? No. Time to take that elevator. travel all right all right just takes you back out here yeah so that warp just takes you back out it doesn't actually lead you anywhere all right so back here again hit the switch Let's look around the library. Looking around the library, we got Yorick's skull. Maybe we could use it. Hmm. Can't use it here. So you have to use Yorick's skull somewhere. Where could we use it? Be like a key item or something. We have to go this way. Just keep hitting this guy through the, the glass. Alright. Uh not the bed. So, I'm gonna safety save here. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna safety save. And maybe I have to fall down that hole. <laughs> maybe I have to fall down the hole. Who knows? Hmm. Yeah, that's instant death. You can't fall down that hole. Okay. <clears throat> Where do you go now? This level's called Gibbet. No. Gibbet. behind this this other door here. Kieran coming with the raid. Yo, Kieran, happy one-year partner anniversary. Hey, thank you for the raid. Gonna shout out to Kieran. Thank you so much for the raid. Appreciate it. How was the rest of your stream? How's your partner anniversary going? And thank you for the 23 months of subs. Damn. Welcome on in. Almost two years. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, this is no. I was not here before. Found a secret. I think I found where I'm supposed to go. Yo, Telepathetic, welcome on in. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Welcome, Raiders. We're playing more Hexen tonight, and I'm getting lost. We're getting lost in Hexen. There we go. Went well. You beat Aladdin on the Genesis. Nice. You know, I gotta play some more Disney games. I really wanna play, um... Gargoyles on the Sega Genesis. Maybe I'll pick that up on uh, Black Friday uh, next week. That's a death. Yep, that's an instant death. Oh, wait, no, not instant death. Yeah, instant death. Load the game, not save the game. Load the game. All right, I thought I found a way to get through here, but we're stuck again. Secret room here. Get these guys. Run over and jump. Ba -na -na. 
Porkalator. Porkalator. The Porkalator. It's time for the Porkalator. It's time for the Porkalator. The Pork. The Pork. It's time for the Porkalator. Okay. So, run out of here again. Okay, maybe I gotta. Let me look a little, 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 little bit extra character here. Need the axe key. We don't have the axe key. Climb up these stairs. Maybe something in this room. Yeah, okay, there seems to be an outside. Maybe we have to figure out how to get out. comes down and gets you. Still hexing around. What's up, purple and gold? Welcome on in. How do I jump? Seems like these are all booby traps. Look around really quick. I'm tempted to look at a guide online, but like the guide, like I said, the guide doesn't help you. The guide tells you you should have this item in your inventory. And I'm like, no, I don't have it in my inventory. Well, look harder. You might have it in your inventory. I may have to take the next room down. Go this way. The steamed glass room looked pretty suspect. Do I give the skull to the thing? Yo, Moxie, welcome on in. Yep. I gave the skull to the statue. What does that do? Up. Oh. Giving the skull to the statue did something. And I'm dead. Okay, so you have to give the skull to the statue. The statue to the skull. And that happens. Something happens. And yeah, he's like holding something. So like, all right, give him the, give him the skull. Um, get the pork later. It's time for the pork later. Time for the pork later. It's time for the pork. No, nope, no, no, no way. It's time for the pork. It's time for the pork. It's time for the pork later. The pork later. The pork later. Here we go. Go around. It's time for the pork. The pork the later. It's time for the pork later. There we go. All right. Run out here. Did we stand on this thing? Let's see here. So this reveals something. Feels like a path. Okay, that did something, all right, but what did that do? Oh, wait, I used the pork later. Damn it. That was like a little jack o' lantern over there. Maybe I just run out of here. Maybe that, maybe that does something in this room now. No. Uh. All right, I'll come back in here. I'll do a quick, a quick save. 
Safety, safe. No, don't load game. Save game. I almost, almost effed up there. <laughs> I knew I was going to do that. Okay, so. Because it looks like this room, inside this room, there's like a door or something I could, I, I could go through. Alright, come on out. my map there's like something like right over here should be like a path or something I'm gonna get killed doing this but watch entertain me nope nothing okay there's nothing down there okay cuz I probably okay so probably have to go back and do something backtrack uh, so maybe take a look at the other rooms. I'm going to take a look at the other rooms. Nothing else. Okay, I'm going down. About this room. Nope, don't have the key. Can't open it. Go down. Uh, go, 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 go. I fell down the damn hole. Damn it. Did I peck, check all my pockets? I think so. Oh, you know, let me check again. Maybe there's another item in my inventory that I didn't get. Nope. Got them all. Nope. Uh, let's try this door here. I have to go back out somewhere. Take it this room. Nope. Come out. Nothing over here. Alright, let's go back out. This room here opened up. Take a nice look. Closer look. Nothing, nothing opened up. Nothing opened up. Uh, I can run in here really quick. Going out. Nothing. Okay. Do I go back to the main castle area? That's, that's the only thing I can think of. switch that was not there before let's see what this does that earthquake shifted this is new i was not in this room before the that earthquake shift did something all right zine c 
Nope, back out. Ethelium. Ethelium. Crap. Ethelium. There you go. Get that mana. Green mana. Switch. Right, if I come out here, some sort of swamp sewer system, I get. Oh, crap. Got here. Jump out. Oh. Out. Bodies everywhere. Hit that switch. Uh oh. Keep attacking. Dungeon key, there we go. Very important key to get out of this level. Right, come on down. There you go. Back to the flush yet. Dungeon key. There's still something over here. Can't open that. Yet. Oh shit. That was scary. There we go. B button. Oh, we're running the, that blue crystal vial. Nope. Nothing. Alright. Spin around. There we go. Oh, there's. Okay. That's new. Go through here. Let's see where this takes us. So now we have the dungeon key. Head on out. All right, let's do a safety save. Bingo. Let's find out where this dungeon key goes. Come on. It takes forever to save your game in this game. Go, perfect. Head out. Action out. Yeah, 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 yeah. B button. Dungeon key. Get. Take him. Oh, this is no. Oh, I'm, it's a good thing I killed all those enemies on screen. Hitting that switch. Does all right, what did that switch just do? <laughs> if I go down here, does that did that open something? Nope, it did not. This way? Anything? Oh, something's down here. Oh, that's a warp point. That's another warp point. We found a warp. Let's see. Let's take it. Ethereal travel. Safety save. Do it. Cool. 
cool. Look down. here and a switch oh fire bats are back that do came out of there before. Okay. Wait, can I go through there? Strafe through? No? Hmm. Locked. Hmm. Get some mana. Combined mana. See, if I hit that switch and turn around, what happens? Remind your viewers to follow. This could be a good time to remind your viewers to follow so they can catch your next stream. Hey guys, drop me a follow. Twitch just sent me a notification saying you guys should follow me. Drop a follow. Notification bell. Do that. <laughs> Make sure you drop that follow. Hit that notification bell. Hit that bell. Keep clicking it until it rings. Wonder if like an actual like like content creation system, if you click the bell, it actually would ring. That'd be pretty neat. Like for April Fool's Day, they, they should do they should do that. If you click the bell when you go and and follow somebody, it should ring and it will scare the crap out of somebody. I almost guarantee that will probably happen. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, anything down here? Alright, climb up here. <laughs> Nothing. So we've been down here before. Got nothing in my inventory. Ring your bell. Ring, ring my bell. I hit 
this switch. What does that switch do? We've been we've been in this room before. It's not like there's uh um hmm. It's not like there's like some sort of hidden room in here. I hit the switch over there. I could probably I probably have to leave this room and this this whole map and go back out. That's my next bet. Just when you think you, you make progress, you're, you're not actually making progress. Alright, so let me run out. Run out of the dungeon. And see if there anything changed outside the map. Alright, run it out. You start here. First things first. Check the uh, the cathedral area. See if anything opened up over here. Nothing. Alright, turn around, go back. Nope, and that's when you die. You fall to your death. Boom. All right, continue. All right, so don't go through the cathedral. Uh, check this out. Anything in this room at all? New rooms, dungeons, etc. Do we see anything? I don't think so. See a new enemy. I open the dungeon door. Anything at all going in here? Nope. Those don't go together. To death. Ugh, don't go down that. Oh. Use that teleport. Get back out. Close one. Thought I had to like use. I thought I had to use something. Other room. Check the other room. This should be like another room. Run out. Nope. Need the axe key. Maybe the axe key was in the dungeon. We ran up, run up here. Did anything open up? This room? No. No. Nothing. I'll take it. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I'm dead. That's okay. I'll just load. Okay. Jump out. I doubt it. Mm. I'm going to run to the restroom really quick. Sit side, everybody. Be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Get my controller. All right, let's see here. Still looking around, and I'm lost. Uh, yeah, I almost think I have to go back into that dungeon. Not, not necessarily finished here. Need the axe key. Waxy coming in with the prime sub. Thank you for the six months. I appreciate it. Enjoy those emotes. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go through the dungeon. Gotta be in this dungeon somewhere. I right, go down this. Oh, I don't think I was in this room. Yes, I was. <laughs> I was in this room before. Okay, zoom in. We hit the switch in this room. There is there like uh much McCall There's no what McCall's in here. Okay. Let's look around some more. I follow. I'm gonna hug the wall. Oh, hit him! Yeah, I'm curious if there's a there's an axe in this. You know what? I see axes. So maybe there is an axe key somewhere that I just missed. There's a nice giant axe in the center of the room. Maybe. Just maybe. Maybe there is an axe that I'm supposed to pick up. There's got to be, like, uh, a key in here. If I hit the switch, what happens in here when you hit the switch? Enemy respawns. If I go back and hit the switch again, does an enemy respawn? Another enemy responds. Two. Maybe I have to keep hitting the switches until something happens. Oh, there's a switch. A switch form. As soon as I kept hit, I kept hitting that switch. Another, like a third and final switch. Oh, that switch was not here. So now that does that switch. Okay, a switch appeared. A switch has appeared, and now we could go up these stairs. In this dungeon, that is so confusing. Why do you gotta keep hitting a switch? You have to hit the switch like ten times. The same switch. That's hexing for you. 
Porkalator. It's time for the porkalator. It's time for the porkalator. It's time for the pork. Time for the pork. Time for the porkalator. What now? It's time for the pork later. It's time for the pork later. What does that do? Pork later time. It's time for the pork. It's time for the pork. It's time for the pork later. Do I hit the same switch for this to open up? Yes, I do. You, you guessed it. stuff. Raid. Thank you so much for the raid, Callus. Get a shout out. Thank you so much for the raid. What were you up to tonight? Aceto Corsa. Hey, Cynthia Junkie. Welcome on in. Playing some uh, Hexen tonight. How you guys all doing? We're getting lost in Hexen. Third, this is our third time, third day playing this. Getting lost. That's our, that's our specialty. Mesh armor. Hitting that switch there. What does that do? It's a racing sim. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're telling me you were playing the... You got the, the racing wheel. We're talking about racing wheels. I remember. Last time we played Hexen. And we got lost. Oh, shit. Somebody shoplifted Pink Gorilla on stream today? Did they catch the guy? I hope they caught the guy. Wait, in, in the International District or the the uh, U District? The UD store, oh shit. Now I wonder if they did that for attention. There's a clip, oh boy. Check it out. I wonder if they did that for clout. You know, because uh, I know there's that there's that YouTube channel, uh, Gas Station Encounters. I think there's like people that where where they uh, they get ca they get caught shoplifting and stealing. And I there's a rumor going around that that some of them so there are people like actually doing that on purpose, just so just for clout. But um, I think that was, I don't think that was true. Seems kind of silly to put yourself in trouble with the law just for clout. All right, I'm seriously lost right now. I thought I made progress, but now it doesn't seem to have made progress anymore. I 
right, go back down. There should be a set of stairs. Let's take that other set of stairs. later. Looking for, still looking for this axe key. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Why would they send us this way? For no reason. Oh, that's where I found this. Uh, I hit the switch in there, the jack-o'-lantern switch. This takes us out here. Maybe there's something that open. Who knows? Climb up here. Yeah, you would think there would be like some sort of key or something here. Maybe there's a switch. Switch. Hmm. That B button. In case something appears. Nothing here. Friends of scheme are cool looking. Yeah, they, they are really cool. I have to agree with you there. I gotta say the frame rate's pretty good for Sega Saturn's uh 3D chip there. Spawning these enemies. Uh, it's like I don't know where to. I don't even know where to go now. Climb up here. This guy. down this room.
Come on. Maybe I gotta use the pork later. The pork later. Hit the button. Nope, that button doesn't turn on anymore. Huh. What does that do? Pot? Pot does nothing. I'm gonna go and try and look more careful now. Let's see. Did I miss anything? Did I overlook anything? Hit that switch. Oh, there's a switch in there. What did that switch do? Hitting that switch, what did this switch do? There was a hidden switch inside one of these cells. What door did that open? Is the real question. One of the, one of the cells did something. Now, did that open another door in in the in another map or something? That's the real question. Let's see. Let's go through this other staircase here. That's a loaded question. What what did that open? Do we look around the whole map again? Let's look around the whole dungeon. Let's see if there anything else opened up. That's probably the only logical thing to do now is to re scout the whole map for any change. Let's see here. Did this side of the map open up? I don't think so. I don't think any of this, any of these guys opened up. I'll hit the, I'll hit the switch again. This guy's trying to kill me. Where did I screw that CRT? I've always had it. <laughs> I've had the CRT since I moved in. Um, I just never actually used it on stream. I was like, hey, I have this CRT in the background. Why don't I turn it on and put something on? Because I've seen other streamers, uh, you know, they have like arcade machines in the background with activity, you know, just because they're not playing it doesn't mean, you know, they can't get any use out of it. So I was like, hey, you know, why don't I do the same? And just put something on the TV in the back. Uh, oh, this is new. This is new. This is new. I was not here yet. Let's see. This is a new... This is new. I was not here before. Actually, no. I was here. This is new. I have not been down this corridor yet. That is new. All right, hold on. Let's do safety save. I have no idea what's inside these little corridors here. I'm guessing this is where you get the uh, the axe key. And I'm guessing the axe key is like the next thing to do. Right, back out. The next thing to explore. Go in here. Get him. Death. Oh! You fall down a hole and it takes you, it warps. Where the hell does this take us? 
Ephilium. Okay, so this just takes us to another part of Ephilium. Oh, it just warps us out of here. Okay. Another part of the map that we were at before. This... This 3D maze. Hold on. Oh, we were here already. Okay. This is just a new spot of the map. That's pretty cool. We're, we're like at a part two of this, uh, this level here. Yo, Dave, welcome on in. Hope you're doing well. What is this? Uh, okay, so that raises the water level. Where the hell are we going? Grab that. Um, I have no idea what I just did there. They're playing Sonic Frontiers. Nice. I gotta play that. I'm gonna get that game on Black Friday because there's supposed to be a sale where that game goes. It, it's half off. I'm gonna pick it up during the sale for the PS5 and it Walmart Walmart sale. It's a beautiful game. Yeah, I, I heard some good things. I heard some bad things, but I'm like, all right, I'll, I'll be my, I'll be my own judge. You know, I'm old enough. Uh, Walmart.com is having a sale. I think on Black Friday or in a or in a few days. It said the 21st. So I'm gonna check it out then. I'm gonna check it out then. I'm gonna check it out then. Okay. Oh. Go in here. I recall. I don't recall being here yet. Oh, oh, oh! I didn't see this guy before. Oh. That's a new monster. Those guys are usually green. Good jump. Hit the switch. What's this? The hell's killing me. What is that? This guy. Got him. Get yours at Target. They match the price if it's, if it's on sale now until January. Ooh. I wonder if I could if I could go to the the Target by me and show them the deal at a uh, Walmart. They probably would. They would probably have to honor it. Wait. What? Wait. It's about to say. Did I get stuck? Be careful when I open that last door. Uh, yeah, so I start here. I think I have to hit a switch though when I come in. Yep, get him. Yep, go that way. What's that behind me? CRT TV with the Streets of Rage 2, the demo. I don't think I even think it's playing a demo, it's playing the intro. The intro. I don't think there was actual gameplay footage. Switch, we're back up. 
a potion. I don't want to use one. There we go. Game make me use potions when I don't need to. Another one on the other side. Let's kill this other guy here. There we go. Easy peasy. Easy effing peasy. Get him on the other side. Oh, there's the there's the portal. I don't want to hit that switch right away. I'm gonna try that second hole. Oh, shield, Falcon Shield. make a run for it save here just make a run for it nice all right what we got inside what do we got what do we got oh 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 Ready, set, run, and jump. No, that's not good. Come on, jump up. Run and 
jump. Okay, cool. So now what happens if I go in here? So there's two portals. So there's two two portals in one of these areas. Where does this one take us? This puts us... Forsaken Outpost. Okay, so... This is... We've been in this area. This is the castle. So we've been here already. Boots of Speed. What's this? Door open in the gibbet? What's a, what's a gibbet? What's a gibbet? This looks familiar. A door open in the gibbet. So that open. The door open in the gibbet. What is a gibbet? We're not in the gibbet. All right, so let's come back out here. The door open in the gibbet. What is a gibbet? Is this a gibbet? No, it's not a gibbet. Oh. This elevator moves now. It's probably gonna take us. Yep, it's gonna take us back here. Jump out here. It was another exit. Right here. Take that exit. Where does that take us? If it's the gibbet, that means get Castle of Grief. Hit the B button. That opens up. Oh. Come on, get out of the way. Okay, so we're back here again. The gibbet. Where is a gibbet? The gibbet. What is what is a gibbet even? What the heck is a gibbet supposed to be? Is the gibbet in here? Open in the gibbet. What is a gibbet? What is a gibbet supposed to be? Is this room the gibbet? That's the gibbet. Okay, so a door has opened in this gibbet. Let's find out what door opened in the gibbet. Go. I don't think it was this room that opened up. It's probably one of those locked doors uh, in this room, probably. Oh, dead. Door was open in the gibbet. Was not this door. And, yep. Yeah. Wasting health right now by going through there. Run. Uh, we check there. Anything in here? Just gotta look around really fast.
Was this the door? Nope, that's not the door. The gibbet. A door open in a gibbet. What gibbet? What gibbets? This room? Nope, nothing. Door in the gibbet. Okay, so we can't open that door. Let's take another look at this room. A door opened up in the gibbet. Oh. Oh! Snap! Now I can go this way. And I get the, was that the axe key? Got the axe key. Oh, okay, so that was the door. There we go, this, this was, uh, th that was not there before. Okay, so we opened, we opened a door. got the axe key now we can open this locked door that was like right here and I'm very anxious to see what's inside there you go that opens up what is this icon of the defender He's back! Bastard's back, the frickin' boss. Fucking asshole. Uh I can't I can't go back. I can only go forward. I gotta kill this guy somehow. around oh. gotta go Rambo style on this boss watch wings of wrath of wrath started back here. Or did I just glitch the boss by going this way?
the boss. There's a boss. He disappeared. Go. Come on. When he lifts his hands, that's when you gotta get away. continue i should have saved before i went in there okay i need to get some mana i need mana you start off with mana okay hold on okay so we know where the door is where they spawn and death instant so we know we know where to go sort of Save before I go in that room. Climb in here, punch the thing, get the axe key, axe key. Don't use my mana sword on the little mini boss before you go in there. Use the mana sword on the boss. That's how we're going to do this. Uh, save game. Here we go. Yeah. This fight right here. Excuse me. Hit it. Icon of Defender. Back over here. Get those flushettes. Get them. Blow up in our face. Lights on. All 
a safety save. Let's fight this boss with the Hexen sword. Maybe he'll go down. Give him the hammer dance. Yeah, I know, right? I got nothing. I got nothing. I got no, uh, I got nothing. Okay. Nope. Yo, Mo, welcome on in. How you doing? This is hard. I should probably just, like, not use my sword on him initially. What's that do? 
Use the use the defender, the anklet. Go up to him with the. Yeah, just go in here. Go up to him like this and just keep chipping away at him. every time I use it on. these like three orbs around him and now they're gone stand on this thing or something? Must be a way, I don't know. Re no, I mean, I'm, I'm out of mana, that's the problem. And I shoot, well, hold on. Maybe I, I need both blue and green mana. Weapon. Yeah, it bounces right off of them if I use it. 
smacking that hammer. Mike, welcome on in. Hey, you doing? Am I supposed to like get on this level and just shoot him? I still have no idea what this this yellow disc thing does. Three health, I did it. I did it on three. Fuck yeah. And he shall journey into the realms of three the health. We did it. And contest with <laughs> now. The do I start there, with full health now? Unto the very gates of despair. But whether he shall return again to the world of light, no man knows. Damn. 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 Indeed. What an asshole. Okay. I think this is the last hub world. I have no health. 
How am I supposed to do this? Wait, I have no health game. You can't do that to me. You can't do that to me, game. I have no health. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck. Okay, there's, there's like a health potion right there. I have no health. I can't do it. All right, luckily the save is I'm not I'm not saving until I get health. If I keep if I keep dying, I'll just reload the level. Got yeah, lost so much in that level. No, oh, dead. I got no fucking health. What am I supposed to do? I got no health. I got nothing to shoot. I have no flechette, whatever that's called. Are you strong enough? No, I'm not strong enough. Alright, I have to like run in there, use a health immediately. Uh nope, that's an instant kill right there. Yeah, I got nothing. I could probably divert them all out and run in there and immediately use the health item. Cause I am not doing that boss fight again. That was hard. Are you strong, strong enough? enough to face your own masters? Face your own masters. Yeah. What the hell does this do? Get it. Run. 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 Run out of the way. Oh, shit. Get the fuck out of my way. Oh, shit. No. 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 <sighs> fuck. Okay, you can... You, all right. <laughs> all right. That fucking sucks. All right. So there is a health item right there. You need the speed shoes. Are you strong enough? Using my speed shoes. Your own Come on. Let's go. Ah, fun duel. Oh, this is terrible. Even if you get the health, it's not enough. Are you strong enough to face your masters? masters? Time just run. Does it open? The portal has been sealed. Uh -oh. Go dead. Oh, damn it. This is tough. This is so freaking tough. Side. Perfect gold giving the gift set to Michael C Games. Thank you so much for that. Oh. Go, 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 go. Go, go, 
I got nothing. Ooh, snap. Ethereal travel. Where does that put me? Ethereal travel. Where does this put me? I got nothing. Dead. Hold on, but if I continue, this will put me right on this level. Ah, cool. I just needed to get some health items. It's a battle of the survival. Survival of the fittest. Got me, shit, a stupid pig. Got me down. All right. Well, I'm not saving until it's safe. Absolutely safe to save. Oh, and I can't back out. Dead. Hold on. Do I have any more health on me? No, I got I got that. Booby traps. Dead. Where's the health item? Yeah, I'm simply just not gonna save. There's no reason to save right now. No health item down there. I have four health. I had to run into this portal. Okay, I got shot with blue. Grab that, and that. Wrench it. What's in here? What's in here? I'm a pig! You turn into a pig! I'm a pig, I turn into a little piggy! I'm a little piggy! I'm a little piggy! Look at this. Wait. Does it wear off? Maybe I'm supposed to be a pig. You become a pig, you get 30 health. There you go, come out of here. All right, I'm out. There you go. Tim and Zax. There you go. I got 28 health. Find them truffles. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a safety save here. Or no. 
Actually, the Sigurn. Fuck yeah. Safety saving. There you go. <laughs> Safety save here. Alright, let's see if we can get to uh, some more health items. I knew we would, fi we would figure it out. Alright. Cool. That's how first person shooters work. Sometimes you gotta go into survival mode. Cool. Cool. Jump out. Let's, oh, there's another. Right that way. Oh, 98. Get him. There. Oh, there you go. Oh. The anklet. Jump out. What happens now? Oh, you gotta become the piglet and then go that way. Hang on. Must become the pig. There you go. Become a pig. Run out and run forward. You start with 30 health as the pig, though. Becoming a pig gets you into this room with all these treasures. Oh, snap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna become a piglet. Alright, become not a pig anymore. There you go. Uh oh. Get everything. It's like the secret room. It's got everything. Power me up. The secret room. All right, so then now you gotta use this and that. Oh, doesn't bring me out at all. How do I get out of here? I just run up and hit B. Man, I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm stuck in this room. Is this just the troll room? Am I like trapped here forever? <laughs> I'm stuck. Yeah, don't save here. This is that's that's like your doom right here. Oh, oh, oh you got to push against the thing. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, wow. You gotta, you gotta push, you gotta push the door. Okay, I got you. All right, that was like a, another troll level right there. All right, how do I get up here now? I'm thinking I have to run on these, these like thing. Oh crap. Get him. I'm thinking I have to jump. Oh, you gotta shoot the. Oh, uh, never mind. You just gotta shoot him. Plus shit. All right, run that way. Just fill up. Alrighty, Rue. That was actually a close call. I was seriously panicking there. All right, do a safety scene. Wow. The fifth hub world. The B button. You shoot it. You go back up. 
Okay, hold on. You don't shoot it. You light that up and then... Oh, interesting. Interesting. That just takes you back. What is that? Hey, it's a porkulator. It's time for the porkulator. Go that way. Ethereal travel. So this just sends us back to that area. We're going to need the sword. It's like, are you powerful enough? I'm like, no. I have no health. Okay, so now we could... Now we could really kick some ass. Blue mana, green mana, all that mana. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh, they're rising from the graves. That B button. something out there. Uh-oh. Well, run in there. What's in, what's in the side here? Uh -oh. Take take the thing. Take the gate. Take the gate. What do we got now? seem to be in a lot better standing than before. Hmm. Zedek's tomb. Oh, I used the wrong freaking thing. Oh, well. Oh, shit. Green mana. Switch. Hit a switch. Oh crap! Ah, booby trap right there in the middle. Something. What is that? The, the segment of segment of whatever. What do we pick up? Pick that. Hey, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome on in. Some hex in a night and making lots of progress. That switch. It's the way hexing goes. What are 
these three items? Puzzle pieces? Nope, disc of repulsion. Can't go that way yet. Huh. I hit a switch. What did that switch do? That opens this side up. Oh. Trap, I don't know. Hit that switch. It'll open up. Get the get the mesh armor, run out. Is there any behind me? Oh, they're all they're surrounded! Same to oh, it's the pork later. It's time for the pork later. became a Jill sandwich. I should have saved. What do I start? I start back here. Okay. I became a Jill sandwich with overnight. Jill sandwich.
miles. the switch and just run away. Run away. Run away. segment. later going. What's the pattern? I'm just gonna get killed because I don't know the pattern. Dead. <laughs> the pattern's gotta be written down somewhere. What you're supposed to hit. Okay. Pattern must be written down somewhere. Se segment of Quidius. Quietus. Oh, 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 oh. 
fuck. There's a panel over there. Maybe I'm supposed to like interact with it and it tells me the code. Circle. There you go. Moon star circle. Oh crap. Motherfucker. Oh, now does the code change every time or we just assume it's moon star circle? I'm just gonna run out. Yeah, I'm just gonna move. Ah, fuck. Come on. Come on, you piece of shit. Get out of fucking my. Here we go. There you go. Run. fucker. There we go. Get out of the way. Get the switch. Run the other way. star circle unless it changes Circle. So 
circle. There we go. No, it's different every fucking time. I knew it. Oh, it's different every fucking time. Crazy. That sucks. That really sucks. You can't just save scum your way over. Hear that, the code wasn't working. These, these guys with the stupid shields are so annoying. Get the mesh armor. out of my way. Come on. There you go. Right in, right in his face. I should just kill these guys like immediately before I go to the next part. That's what I'm thinking. Because it's like every time I'm, I'm just like getting killed by them every time. Go that way. Motherfucker. Come on. There we go. Grab that. Grab all the mana. It's different every time. It's so different every time. What a scam. Oh, come on. Oh, you spawn? You actually spawn? Moon. Moon. There you go. Open up. What happened here? this Wait, is this a fight? I have to fight you? What, what, what is this? Clave seal? What the hell did I just pick up? What is this? I picked up a seal. The hell is the clave sealed? Oh. Run. Run out of here. Run, Charlie, run! Get the get the you got the, the chocolate factory, the ticket, the golden ticket, run! Charlie, run! Out we go. Here we go. All right, where do we go next with the seal? Oh shit, run out of here. I think I know what you're supposed to do with this item. Oh, 
Baird from the door inside. Okay. Buddy named Chris. Oh shit, shit. There was a start here. There is a room, right? Yep, yeah, man. There you go. That's one. You have to get two more seals to open that door. Uh, where are you supposed to go? At least, the, at least we could. It, it loads up right here. Oh shit! Like immediately, immediately, your grounds for like death right there. There's a thing in there. There's health in there. Get him. Go. Health in here. Run. Wall. Oh, run this way. Oh fuck! Come on, you asshole! Dead. Motherfucker! Just they, 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 these guys just come out you like fucking crazy all right so i can't use my sword because it's under power and i'm immediately dead Get out of here. find the find the gate kind of have to get familiar with this map up oh. oh, oh. here quartz flasks What? Damn it! Hit it! What do you mean I can't use it? I was using it! What do you mean I can't use it? I just used it before! Oh my god, what a fucking shitty game! There you go. Open up. I'm gonna hide in here. Hide in there. Portal's been sealed. Okay, oh, so you could run in there. It's <sighs> okay, so you could run in that room. It gives you more mana. And uh, grab, grab it. That's where 
I came at it. Come on, jump, 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 jump. Finally found a way out. What's next? Ethereal travel. Did I stream the blood series? Hey, Paul, welcome on in. Maestro guy. So much going on indeed, Maestro. All right, hold on. I guess this is a good safety saves. No, no, you piece of shit. Oh my gosh. You fucking asshole. You fucking asshole. Here we go. That's how it begins. Oh, okay, so now I have to run out, use the thing. Uh, yep, yep, nope. Nope, nope. Nope, get, get out of my fucking face. Dead. Where the fuck are those? 
those health items. Now save <laughs> medieval on their asses yeah so i meant to save my game here instead i loaded like a fucking fool there we go finally oh biggest fail right there i got oh, this game is just oh, gets on your nerves so badly back out Guys, just spawn. No breathing room whatsoever. Oh. What happened here? Am I close to the end? I, I think so. I don't know if I'm gonna finish this tonight, though. I don't know if I'm gonna finish it. Unless this is like the final boss or something. I, I don't think. I don't know. There's room for next time. What is this? Switch. Or. stuck in here let's see they just keep coming out like crazy Okay, so there's like a certain one I was supposed to select. Thought so. Ice. There's this. Okay, so there's a certain title you have to hit. Oh, I see now. You hit the tile that corresponds to the, the center block. Good day, welcome on in, how you doing? 
Yeah, we're back. And I raged quit. I raged pretty hard. On one part. Because I accidentally loaded my game instead of saving. And I had to... I had a setback. <laughs> it's actually, uh, I, I didn't mind the setback too much. So, but... Dead. Feel strong, man. Okay, so yeah, I hit that one. You hit the right button corresponding to the block in the center. Circle. Stage. Okay. So then you hit the triangle thing right here. And then, what is this level in the shape of? Circle. There's a there's a dot in the center. I assume it's level with a dot in the center. Castle of Grief was uh, was good. That one was that that last boss. That boss was hard. with the dot in. Center. Castle Grief, yeah. Use it. This one's all puzzle, I see. The end in the center. Oh. Block, they reappear. The ends this one. Oh, these guys. And I became a Jill sandwich like three times also on, on that one level. Just a flush it. There's one part on the castle where I, 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 I was falling down a pit. I was like, oh no, I died. I'm like, oh wait, no, I teleported. I didn't die. I was the game trolling me again. Okay, there's lines on the wall. That's probably this one. Lines on wall. What's this one coming up? Bingo. And then this is just circles. This is circle. This one right here. Oh, that's easy. Hey, we got them all. That should have given us something. We get a prize for different one?
something else. Got something. Head out. Save here. Run out through the portal like crazy, go to the next door, and then there's one more thing to get, I guess. Hmm. Head out. Run out and put that thing away. And then there's one more. That was pretty easy. Oh. There we go. There's one more. Where do we go? Real question. Hit this part from the inside. I wonder why. We already went through this cave here. Try going in here. No, no, no. Open that door. at the game a lot. Alright, we already know about that. This suck. What is this? Maybe there's something in the center. We've already been through this wall. Barred from the inside. I'm open the door somehow. Thank you. 
Yo, hello, dog. Welcome. Hell, dog. Welcome on in. I playing Hexen. Yep, Sega Saturn version. And I'm lost. This is a good game. Yeah, I like it. Hard. A hard game. Door because I need the third item. Oh, poison. Don't go in there, do I? No. Editions with DLC, yeah. Let me try one more time. I'm like seriously lost. I thought I saved before I entered that door. have lost look for for ages the highest on the highest difficulty right, hold on let's let's back out do safety save let me try one attempt on this because i should go to bed soon i got work in the morning let's see do one attempt here at least we found the crypt it's so lost in the game back out Switch. 
bitches. What happened was that? Oh. Oh. This must be the final guy. question is, how the hell did I get in here? Uh, very easy getting in, getting out. Seem to. Two discs meant a good game, yeah. Or lots of FMVs, that's what that meant. Uh, shit. How do I get out of here? I got my. Got what I want. Got my uh, my artifact. But where's the exit? Does that open up? What does that mean? Shit. Oh, that's right. I came from here. Just run out. Should just save really quick. Run for that tomb. Let's see what happens now. <clears throat> Running for the tomb. What does that do? I'll get out. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
How do I get that? song for Hexen? I guess so. Uh, oh wait, here it is. Yep, there's the door. It's slowly coming down. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Come down. Ah, I gotta wait for this stupid elevator. It's just, I just want to see what's behind this door. If it's the final boss and we just like cream, we, we finish it out, boom, then that's good. Who knows? We'll see. Another? Oh shit. That was super cool. They're all over. Run it out. travel best game yes i guess so what is behind here save let's see what happens still hex hey paro i think this is the last part because <laughs> i peeked at macaw's playthrough i think this is the end let's see if we could do it that's why they gave us all that mana Why is, why is it giving us all this health items? time so i have to get to bed but i just want to see how far we can get so far we're getting pretty far oh that's a booby trap right there corax is easy Can we open this door now? We got more. Doesn't even have a serpent. Oh shit. discs do. I love how I'm like all the way into the game and I don't even know what the discs do. Oh, I hit my boots. I didn't want to do that. J. 
legit coming with the raid. That's a huge raid. Thank you so much for that raid, Jay Shred. Appreciate it. We're at the very end. Welcome, Raiders. I think we're about to beat Hexen. I have work tomorrow. I have to get up at 8 a.m. It's 3.10 a.m. 3.10 a.m. I have to get up. I have to go to work. How am I going to pull it off? Hey, good Jared. Welcome on in. How you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Let's see. Where the hell's... How do I get out of here? Hey, Suey. Welcome. How are you doing? Where do we go? Thanks to you for forwarding the love. I appreciate it. Um, how... Oh, wait. There's one more guy right here. Body has always been blessed with only needing five hours of sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see here. Let's do this. We can beat this guy. That's a boss. Disappeared. Oh, snap. You get more mana in there. I'm going for the mana. The game really cares. from the save point okay so there is there's mana to the right tired woke up refreshed in 30 years With a scream of agony, you are Wicky wrenched Hexen. from this world into oh, another. Done. Every part of your body wreathed in mystic fire. When your Did vision it. clears, That's you over. find yourself standing in a great hall. In the distance, you can see done. a raised dead. Another game down. And upon it, the only source of light in this world. This can only be the Chaos Sphere, the source of Karax's power. With this, you can create worlds or destroy them. 
By rights of battle and conquest, it is yours. And with trembling hands, I rode the Serpent Raider. Must be playing Hexen. Can you start a new player will join the cosmic game of power? I think that suddenly the very reaches of the board seem to be within your grasp. But there are other players mightier than you. And who can know their next moves? The end. Alright, that was Hexen. Oh, credits. Hey, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. A to D design credits. Oh! A to D, I get it. So the book was A and D in the uh, the castle. Hey, we beat it. All right, good stuff. We did it on a J Dread raid. <laughs> awesome. And the good Jared was there to see the whole thing. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for the GGs. Yeah, Adam, we'll come on in. Thanks to the GGs, we beat Hexen. Busted in. Hexen ain't easy. Yeah, so many dead ends. I think I got lost the most on, I think it was the third hub world. I got like seriously lost for like three hours. No joke. And then I finally made it through. But it's over. That's Hexen. That is Hexen. Only bad thing about Hexen is that it ends. Yeah, I have to play a Hexen, uh, I gotta play Hexen 2. Hexen. Raven software. We can't skip the credits. I was like, all right, he's dead. Perfect. I'm just gonna run out of here really quick. And I ran out on one. Michael Raymond Judy. Eric C. Beesman. Bestman. Show a random retro item. We got it. Well, um. Let's see. What we got there? Three copy of Star Soldier for the uh, N64 is the Japanese version. If you like shoot 'em ups it's a pretty good game. Such a random retro. John Carmack. It's software. John Rom John Carmack. John Romano. John Romaro. Romano. John Romero. I said John Romano. My, my brain is fried, it's late. <laughs> Sean Green, Projects Man, Barrett Alexander, GT Interactive. So many people that worked on John Daikatana, <laughs> Michael Walston. Ugh, I gotta set my alarm for tomorrow morning. Let's see, let's do that right now. See how much sleep I'll probably get. Truth be told, I probably wouldn't, probably wouldn't be, uh, <laughs> I probably wouldn't be sleeping that much anyway tonight. Uh, because it's tomorrow's Friday. All right, did we get anything for beating the game? I don't think so. Nah, that's it. Alrighty, cool. No hidden difficulties, Titan. Alrighty, Drew. Alright, that takes us to the end of Hexen. Well, thank you all for coming to my stream. I appreciate it. Sorry, I gotta cut the stream so, uh, short. I gotta go to work tomorrow. But join me tomorrow night, everybody. We're gonna play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. I got the credits, but tomorrow night we're going to play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. I've never played the English version on Twitch. Simpsons game? No, it's the it's uh, Streets of Rage 2. We're going to play Castlevania Symphony of the Night tomorrow, and I'm going to kick the shit out of this game tomorrow. So tune in tomorrow, 10.30 p.m. Eastern. We'll play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Follow me up on my socials. I'm on Twitter, Discord, YouTube, and Instagram, and TikTok. Follow me all there. Hit that follow and notification bell so you know when we go live. Thank you all for coming out. Appreciate all the raids and the gift subs and follows. Let's go raid somebody. We'll go pass this party, this raid party off to someone tonight. And uh, let's see here. I think the new Pokemon game came out. Uh. 
people playing Pokemon. Let's raid Pebbles. She's playing Pokemon. Everybody go say hi to Pebbles. If you sub the channel, you can use the first message. If not, use the second one. Everyone have a good night. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. Good night, everyone. Later. Happy Friday. Four.